so hey guys welcome back to my channel hope you're doing extremely well and this is your very own mass code at this side so today's problem is find missing in second array and let us solve this problem without wasting any more time okay so the question says that you have been provided with two arrays okay so your array a is actually one two three three four five six seven seven right this is your array a and your array b is given to you as one two three six right you can see the arrays can be of different sizes suppose this size is n this size is m now the only task you have to perform is you have to find the elements find the elements which are in a which are present in a but not in b they should be present here but not here okay but this is your condition now how can you solve it okay so the question is really simple today it is the brute force approach says now i want the elements which are in a right but not in b so what i will do i will say traverse a i will say traverse a okay if i go to one right i want to find the like if i am here I definitely know that this is part like this is the part of a right now the second condition says says it should not be a part of b so i will check in the b if it is a part of b right i will check in b so i will say traverse a for each element in a if like for each element in a what you have to do you have to traverse b if during this traversal during this traversal if same element is found in b if same element is found in b break and do not add and do not add into the answer break and do not add it in the answer otherwise if all the elements like uh, if the element doesn't exist in b in that case push your value into the answer push your value into the answer okay so how will the code work how will the code work the code will work something like this for i equals to 0 up till n minus 1 assuming n is the size of the array a right what i will do i will first construct a vector of int answer to store my answer right then my element is a of i right okay after that i will traverse my array b for j to m minus 1 assuming array of uh, size of array b is m right okay if b of j equals to equals to ele in that case break right in that case break and if the loop has broken in between then j will never reach m j will never reach m so i will use that so if j equals to equals to m in that case answer dot push back ele and move forward right and move forward and that in that case return answer after both the loops are ended right return answer right now what is the time complexity here again nested loops o of n square this should be well versed with you right now okay o of n square and space complexity o of 1 not o of 1 we are actually keeping the answer so you can say o of um, answer arrays answer elements right o of answer elements whatever is required right okay now let us move to the optimized approach all right so let us look at the optimized approach now okay so i want the elements which are present in this and not present in this right okay the approach i can use is i can use a count or a frequency map or a set frequency let us say set only right set okay what I will say, I will insert the elements of B into a set. So my set becomes like 1, 2, 3, 6. Right? 1, 2, 3, 6. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 6. How will you do it? How will you do it? Okay. So 1, 2, 3, 6 in the set row now. Right? Now I will traverse each element in A. So for I, in I going from Z, um, Okay. So for i going from 0 up till n minus 1 where n is the length of the array a. 
okay if let us name this set as st if st dot find a of i equals to equals to st dot end now what does that mean what does that mean b stores the element or st stores the elements of b and this condition says a of i that means element is existing in the a and b stores the element of st if this condition is persisting that means element is in the a and not in the b so in that case i will push that element so answer dot push back a of i right and move forward and this is the only loop and you will see return answer now what is the time complexity here time complexity is o of m log m for inserting elements into the set right and space complexity is o of m because we are making a set of elements of b this is the only case you have to tackle right and this was the easy question so i don't think that this needs much of an explanation let us move to the code clearly right so before moving to the code i would request you guys to follow me on instagram and linkedin and connect with me and also do not forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the like button okay so let us start the code so our code says we have to make a set of the elements of b so unordered set of type int let us name it as st now after that for int i going from 0 i less than uh, m because m is the size of b st dot insert b of i right and after that i will make a vector of int answer and then traverse a so for int i going from 0 i less than n i plus plus if st dot find that is i'm trying to find element ai in the set of b b elements right is equals to equals to n that is i didn't find any element named as o element equals to a of i in the uh, elements of b in that case i will say answer dot push back a of i and after that return your answer this is the only code you have to write and let us come try to compile and run it hope it will work fine okay working fine for the uh, example test case and let us try to submit as well in the meantime i request you guys to hit the like button if you are able to understand the concept of the questions and you can see our current streak is 126 days so thank you for watching and we'll meet tomorrow with a new video thank you have a nice day